Welcome Grab back. The Riverside and Great Northern Railway is celebrating 75 years this week in the 608. Our Josh Brider live in Wisconsin Dells with a preview. Hey Josh. Hey guys, good morning. Our tickets are officially pumped, are punched here and we are all aboard right now. Jim, we're ready. Eyeball, 82. And we are off here at Riverside and Great Northern Railway. We're taking you for a little ride in the 608 on this beautiful Tuesday morning. Tom Lines aboard with us this morning. You were running the train a little earlier, and now you're you're riding with us. We do everything here, <laughs> whatever needs to be done. You know, such a fun morning. You guys are celebrating 75 years. I mean, that is an amazing accomplishment. Yeah, as a nonprofit, this business has been run that way since 1989. And uh, now what we're doing is celebrating the 75 years here uh, this Saturday. We start at around 9.30. Trains will run until, well, if we have a big crew of people, we'll just keep running and running until nobody's left. So talk about the train that we're on right now. Sure. The 82 actually was built uh, for the Milwaukee Zoo at the shops that we're driving by now. Actually, the sister engine, the 98, is right here on our left. That is uh, the blue engine that you're looking at right now. That engine was built for the Hoot Toot and Whistle in Elgin, Illinois, and now it's come back here. And that's part of our, our mission here is to preserve steam and, and the engines that were originally built here in the 50s and 60s. You know, this takes a lot of work to keep going, right? It, it takes an enormous amount of work. Uh, we have uh, over 250 members and we probably have 30 to 50 active volunteers that uh, come all the way from Florida and will spend their entire summer here. You know, this is pretty special for the Dells and something that many, many folks come to every single year. Yeah, this is a this is one of the Dells' original attractions, which uh, is kind of cool. And it's very unusual because we're just far enough out in the woods that it's very peaceful. And so a lot of people come out here. They didn't realize it was out here. They'll picnic out here and spend the day with us. All right, so if folks have never been here before now is the time this is the week to come yeah exactly so uh, we'll have music we'll have food uh, we'll have train rides and a lot of games for the kids a lot of different things to do this weekend you know what is your favorite part about being out here oh boy uh, I love the trains I've, I've been a train Jim was saying before how the Milwaukee Zoo was one of his favorite places and that's where I originally uh, learned to fall in love with the trains. Awesome. Well, Tom, thank you so much for everything this morning. This is so much fun. I mean, we're literally on a moving train right now. We are. We are out in the middle of nowhere in Wisconsin Dells. It doesn't get any better than this. Tom, thank you so much. We appreciate it. If you'd like to learn more about their 75th anniversary celebration this weekend, you can go to the story up on channel3000.com. Leah and Shane, this is pretty amazing. We pulled it off this morning. Look at this. We are in the Wisconsin Dells and moving along just fine here in the 608. <laughs> Only Josh Spryder. How about a little uh, hoot toot and whistle? Is that what we got? Let's see your best one, Josh. <laughs> Can we get another whistle? Choo choo. <laughs> That's so great. Let's hear it. Oh, nothing. Oh, nothing. All right. <laughs> this is so great. 75 years. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Hey, 75 years, that's no small task. Really cool stuff. It's big deal. Josh Breider, thank you very much. Love hoop toot and whistle to send him off. Remember to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. You can reach out to him on social media or shoot him an email for a chance to be featured. Do you see that gorgeous Wisconsin countryside behind him, too? Beautiful. How fun. Awesome oh, stuff. Tough assignment today.